It has been six years to the day that Metroid Prime 4 was revealed at E3 2017. Where were you when this game was announced? Because I was in the middle of a motel screaming my head off. It was such a great time. Unfortunately, the game was rebooted by Retro Studios about a year and a half later, so the game that's being worked on right now was not the same one that was announced six years ago. Still, that brings me to the topic of today's video. Retro Studios is hiring for a VFX artist. What's interesting is that this job seems to have been posted today on the six year anniversary of this reveal because Nintendo of America Careers shared this posting today, so chances are it was posted on the careers page as well. So what does this mean? They're hiring a VFX artist. Does this mean the game is even further off than we think? Okay, no. Not at all. I've been saying this for years. Just because a game studio is hiring for something, it doesn't mean that's an indicator on when we can expect that thing to come out. Most game studios, to my understanding, are always hiring up until the end of development on projects, and maybe it's because they're just looking for contractors to do some finishing touches, or they're maybe going to move on to the next project after this project is finished. That's just my understanding of how I think some game developers work. But either way, I know for a fact that this job listing isn't any indicator on when we're going to finally see the game. However, I am still inclined to believe that we're going to see something significant of Metroid Prime 4 this year. I mean, Metroid Prime Remastered came out earlier this year, and if Nintendo has been sitting on that completed project since summer 2021, as rumors have suggested, then that must mean Nintendo's gearing up for a sort of Metroid Prime 4 blowout, if you will. Even though we don't know anything about Nintendo's fall 2023 or winter 2023 lineup, I still think this game is coming out maybe early 2024 or mid-2024, but that doesn't change the fact that I think we're gonna see something. We're gonna see a trailer, get some gameplay going this year. I'm just really excited because six years of waiting, six years of just looking at this logo, that being all we really know about this game, along with that concept art that Retro just put on their Twitter banner last year for some reason, that being all we know about this game, I'm ready to find out more. I am so ready to see what my most anticipated game of all time looks like. 